Hey guys, it's Kyle from the Clash, and today I'm using a new video, and this is just a video showing the vi the attack I did not show you guys yesterday. And as you guys can see, they did lose by three, sadly. But I want to show you guys this attack right about here on Jason by Brandon, the level 300. So right here, he's gonna attack from the right side, as you guys can see, a three golem, go wee wipe, I guess. Or just go, or just go wee wee. Yeah, go, go wee wipe technically, because he has a P.E.K.K.A. But I don't know, honestly, kind of like go wee wipe. I just, let's call it that, okay? Or we go wipe, it doesn't matter. Either way, he's going in. He uses that rage to accelerate them. Then he freezes part of the clan castle, which was pretty good. And he also freezes a test line in Inferno. So, good, good freeze there. And Archer Lynn's going in, he's about to take out the Inferno Tower and the Tesla. And she hops over, and she's about to lock onto the town hall soon. And then over here, there's a witch working on with the wall with the golem. And then she's about to take out the town hall, so that's good for him. He already secured the one star. Then he just got the two star, and he's just going to let it go for percentages. So let's just speed up this raid over here, because he does get like 71%. He's Archer Queen's ability, he gets through the wall, takes out the cannon, and doesn't take out the cannon, gets close though. Basically, he wraps up this raid with a nice 71%. So yeah, nice raid by Brandon. Also, I want to show you guys the raid that happened on Brandon. And it was a, it was obviously a zero star, as you guys could see. And he has a fully maxed out base, as you guys can see. Again. So I think he's using like go wee wee because he I did not see any Pekkas. Yeah, I did not see any Pekkas. So he's gonna rage. I think he used the same exact strategy that he, Brandon used on him. As you guys can see, he used the same exact rage spell right next to the town the wall. Sadly, it's not gonna work out for him. So I think maybe Brandon got attacked after he attacked. So we'll see later. Basically, he's spreading out his wizards. It looks pretty decent right now, but the only problem is, is that he could not take out the clan castle because the witches were stuck behind the wall. So that really screwed him in the butt, and that's what really cost him the raid, to be honest. Because if there wasn't for the clan castle, he would have been able to one star easily, maybe even two star. But probably not two star, we'll see. It, it, honestly, we can't see because oh, I'm so stupid. We can't see because the raid already, like, was a fail. But yeah. So that little golem over there is just going to jump over the wall by itself. The wizards and witches are not even going to follow, which is kind of stupid, but well, it, it depends on their AI, I don't even know. But anyways, that really kind of wraps up this raid. As you guys can see, I'll just speed up this because everything's just about to get killed. And it's going to end with a zero stars and a win for YouTube Gaming Squad. Sadly, they did not win the war, but it was a nice visit to their clan just to show you guys these raids and yeah by the way also me and mike as you guys already know probably let me show you guys if you guys do not know let me just show you guys the clan oh he's not there right now but basically there's a guy called mike okay he's he's a max on on 10 except for his walls me and him are buds anyways me and him are gonna start a war or not a war he's gonna start a clan later on in the summer, not right now, because right now, I want to focus on school and on farming. I don't feel like pushing, because when you push, you can really get easily people off of global easily, especially if you're in Champions League. So what me and him are planning to do is that we're just going to push and maybe even start a, a clan in the summer. So stay tuned to that. Maybe. We'll see. And anyways, yeah. And I thank you guys for watching. It's some guys in the Clash. And I'm sorry that my voice kind of sounds weird. Or let me not. Let me. Let me. Let me. Let me not close the video so fast. Anyways, so I made an air defense upgrade. I forgot to do it yesterday, so I did it today, like an hour ago. This was I was upgrading because you guys already know. This was about to finish, and yeah, that's my base. My lava hounds are upgrading level two, and my witches already maxed, and my golems are already maxed for town online. So yeah, and then um, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah, leave a comment below of what video idea you guys want me to do because I kind of just running around showing you guys different replays of high level people so tell me if there's one in particular you guys want me to show um for example like a famous youtuber I actually can join the clan for I you can't just like make a mega empire Asia for example with Brandon I can't join there too hard over there I'm, I'm way too low compared to them 
But basically, that is it. And also, check out Brandon's YouTube channel. It's it's called Clash of Clans and like the dash, like the um the vertical dash thingy, and then Brandon. So check it out. His YouTube channel is like at twenty four thousand or something. I remember when I subscribed to him, it was at like two thousand. Then a few weeks later, he was already at like twenty k. So go subscribe to him. He definitely makes some really good videos, and they're very informational. Honestly, his videos are amazing. Like I learned so much from them. So go and check him out if you guys want more tips. And comment below what video you guys want to see next because I kind of I'm just doing this for you guys honestly. I could care less what video ideas I do, but if it doesn't benefit you guys, there's honestly no point. Because I'm doing this for you guys. I want you guys to enjoy. I want you guys to learn from this. So comment below what video guys ideas you guys want to do. And please don't make a dark elixir farming. You guys don't want to know how I farm it honestly. Okay, because you guys are just gonna want to hate me. Okay, you know what? I'll just show you. Don't kill me. No. Yeah, basically that explains everything. No, that's honestly the best way to farm. Many people are probably going to hate me after saying this, but that is one of the best ways to farm Dark Elixir. Honestly, like, if you find a guy with, like, 2k, you can probably get, like, a thousand Dark Elixir from just lightning spelling him. And I don't really care about Elixir, so that's not even a problem for me. But if you really want to go hardcore Dark Elixir farming, ask me in the comments. I'll probably do a video on them. I don't usually use it, but I'll probably be able to do it. And you can always just barge for it. But yeah, comment below if you guys want to actually see a Dark Elixir farming video. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. It's been Captain Clash, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.